Okay. Sometimes some people may ask me like in the comment section may ask me for help and some of the time I may post these words here that I am going to read to you so sometimes I guess sometimes some people may not really want to read much so let me read it to you okay please follow this consider this number one believe in Jesus Christ don't think of him as an imaginary person he is not number two change your mind about sin take no interest in it <clears throat> will you still sin if you have no interest in it possibly confess your sins to God first John chapter 1 verse 9 King James Version speak to him as if he is right next to you. It may sound strange, but I believe it is necessary. 1A Example God, please forgive me for all my sins. I think I say this or something similar to it. If you are able to remember, I think it is a good idea to name each individual sin you have done. Maybe this is A and this here is A1. A1, example. God, please forgive me for lying to my mother, stealing a can of Mountain Dew, committing adultery with my neighbor's wife, using foul language with Tommy, getting drunk last night, speaking rudely to Sarah, etc. Number two, or maybe this is Uh, I think that is number, no, it's number three. This should be three and this should be four. So, three. Follow the rules in the Bible. I don't believe we are under the law of Moses. Number three or four. <laughs> four. Always trust in God and be patient with him. Okay. I recommend you to do these things. Number one, try to stay away from anyone that is sinful unless you are trying to help or tell them about Jesus Christ. Number two, stay away from filthy and perverse entertainment. A, so under two, A, movies and television shows that display sinful situations and have filthy language. B, Music with filthy language and or sexual content, which is very important to stay away from these things. Number three, dress modestly. Don't dress in a way to attract 
sexual attention from people, which I believe is so common, that seductive way of dressing. Okay, so this concludes this document. I hope you have learned something. May God bless you.